one it's Diane and this is the angel hug for Wednesday November the 13th and I almost said October the 13th and I'm kind of thinking wow there's a really weird thing that I need to mention so it's something to do with going backwards in time in order to go forward which does remind me of a mercury retrograde I have to say so it's really the energy of moving forward is really starting to build now so just make sure that whatever it was that you were looking at in October whatever it is that you were re-evaluating re and reassessing whatever it is that you've brought into the beginning of this month as okay I need to make a decision before I go forward let that be kind of sewn up and wrapped up today and I'm choosing a card from the unicorn deck because I really just associate unicorns with purity and truth and purity and truth are very important aspects of ascension because the more we clear ourselves the more we raise our frequency so the more the purer we become and I'm not talking about purity in the sense of I don't know anything judgmental or moralistic you know when you're in a state of purity and what that means to you and what is appropriate and what it does for you in terms of your ability to connect and no one else can tell you what that means. Unicorns, however, are extremely pure. And I just want to read the card. So today the card is soul satisfaction. And it says, aim for that which makes you your soul rejoice. Aim for that which makes your soul rejoice. So if there are any questions today about which direction to move forward in, connect with your joy, connect with what it is that makes you feel really, really amazing. And I'm not talking about the thing that you think, oh, this is an okay thing to do for a living. I mean, the thing that lights you up, that makes you really excited to get out of bed in the morning, that makes you go to sleep with a smile on your face. And I'm not telling anyone to be irresponsible. I know that there are, you know, other things that need to be done to earn a living. And, you know, not everyone is in that situation where they can just immediately sort of up sticks and say, okay, I'm going to go and join a a traveling band or the circus however include in your day and in your intentions in terms of what you intend to grow and develop and evolve in the coming months include in all of that and in your decision about how to go forward now the thing that makes your soul rejoice the thing that really really lifts you up and makes you just oh, glad to be alive. So that's the message for Wednesday and I'm going to pick another message from the unicorns and I'm also going to say I'm being reminded to connect it to ascension. So of course when we're doing what makes our souls sing we are bringing an amazing quality of light to the planet because we're not blocked, we're not resentful, we're not thinking oh I should do this and I should do that and therefore shutting down. Sometimes even in service it's possible to feel obligated or heavy and it should never feel like that. If you're in service in some way and you're feeling any kind of heaviness, bring some creativity into your service mission to lift it again because service is a very high vibration. If it feels heavy, then you're not serving in the right way, so reevaluate that. And I think that's maybe all I need to say about that. So let's see the next card magic. I love that card. That's the perfect card to add to that message. And it says, there is magic around you, so expect excitement and joy. And I would say to that, expect excitement and joy, but create excitement and joy as well. Don't sit around waiting for a knock on the door, okay? Go out to meet excitement and joy. Decide to do what it is that brings excitement and joy back into your life. Do you need to get your tap shoes out? Do you need to get a pen and paper out and go and sit down in the woods somewhere and start writing poetry? Do you need to call someone up and say, oh, let's, let's, I don't know, get together and start a choir. Whatever it is that you feel you need to do to really light yourself up, Wednesday is the day to start exploring that. Have a great Wednesday, everyone, and I'll be back tomorrow. Thank